oh no microsoft you are doing this again like upgrading to windows 11 version 24s to forcely this is not right you guys also thinking like this like a forcely upgrading but always this is not the case why microsoft forcely upgrade you and if it is forcefully installing in your system you are really lucky guy just follow the full video you will understand microsoft automatically upgrading to windows 11 version 24s2 if you are using windows 11 version 23s2 and 22s2 especially for windows 11 home and pro edition if you are using enterprise version you are safe and if your system is managed by it department you are also safe i will let you know everything like why it is happening and how you can stop it should you upgrade to windows 11 24s2 or not everything is going to be explained in this video as you can see this is the official page of microsoft support document windows 11 version 24s2 no issues and notifications starting off january 16 2025 in their support document they are also saying we have reached a new stage in the phased rollout of version 24s2 eligible devices running home and pro editions of windows 11 version 23s2 and 22s2 will gradually upgrade it to version 24s2 this automatic update target only devices that are not managed by it department so basically let me tell you this is not happening for all the pcs so microsoft just choose the most compatible devices for this version and they just making that compatible devices as a group so they are pushing this update to that group only not for everyone if your system is fully updated there is no compatibility issues you can just go and check for update it will pop up in your windows update so why this automatic update is important to you better security new update fixes security problems in ordered versions of windows so for better security this is mandatory this is also easier for developers like by having everyone in the same version it is simpler for developer to create apps that work well for everyone another one is faster fixes updates are rolled out gradually so microsoft can get the feedback and fixes issues before the update reaches to everyone this helps microsoft to maintain a smoother and faster experience for all users so there is no big issues in this update microsoft also don't want to upset you why they are going to do this so they are just slowly rolling out this update or automatically upgrading to windows 11 version 24s2 so currently i'm using windows 11 version 24s2 and uh, i'm a normal user and doing my development tasks so basically what you can do if you don't want to get this update just pause the update and that's it and if you don't want to pause you can use edit group policy so just uh, type here edit group policy open it go into computer configuration administrative windows component here you can see windows update you can also see here manage update offered from windows update here you need to set the target feature update just double click on it check this enabled here you need to specify like windows 11 and the current version you are running like windows 11 version 23s2 or 22s2 and now it is not going to upgrade to windows 11 version 24s2 whenever microsoft end the support of windows 11 version 23s2 so after some days it is automatically upgrade to windows 11 version 24s2 click here apply and ok and you are good to go check for update you are not going to get windows 11 version 24s2 and maybe in future you want to undo this so what you can do just set it not configured click here apply and ok and all set so this is how you can pause this update or stop this windows 11 version 24s2 update so let me know in the comments what do you think about this update and what you most like about this version 24s2